What's up guys, Vec here, bringing you an unboxing. It's the first one on the channel, uh, apart from, I guess, some booster packs, but that's not really an unboxing, per se. Uh, I haven't done a booster box or anything like that either, so, again, not a box. But, uh, I don't know what it is yet. But here it is. It's a pretty fucking big box. Uh, I have an idea as to what it is, but I'm not 100% sure what it is. I have a good idea though. I have a good idea. Come on camera, focus you jerk. Uh, I don't have <laughs> an eye for anything so we're just gonna have to use the screwdriver here. That's gonna have to do. Uh, but yeah, let's let's just crack it open and see what's in. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. This is not exactly the best thing to open a box with, I'll tell you that much. There we go. I'm going to start using my sword for this kind of stuff. Not that it's sharp. I have to sharpen it first. It's not exactly impossible to do. I don't do many unboxings though, so I don't think it's worth my time to sharpen it. Though seriously, I'm pretty badass using a sword instead of a fucking screwdriver. Oh, that, that voice. Wow. Alright. What's in... Oh, is it one of the... Ah, oh, it's the fucking... Right. Okay. I see how you play your games, Amazon. I see how you play your games. Is that at least... Nope. Oh my god. Ugh. Ugh. There we go. Nailed it. Let's get that open. Oh, okay. Alright. It is what I thought it is, but oh my god, that's a big box. Alright, let's get that done. There you go. That's what this is. Now, I am wearing a headset, yes, but this is actually... It looks a hell of a lot nicer. I can tell you that much. Like This one's good. It's the Plantronics GameCon... Um, 780, I think. I don't know. I can never remember the exact uh, name or numbers or whatever, but... There you go. That's it outside of its 17 million packagings. There you go. That's the actual box itself. Pretty nice box. Very high quality. It feels very good. It's got some uh, matte and some smooth finishes on it. Uh, that's the other side... Uh, and again, that's the back. Looks very good. Very heavy box. That's for sure. Uh, let's get this baby open. Again, using my trusty dusty micro screwdriver. Ugh, oh, come on. This is going to be like the longest part of the video is just opening the damn thing. Oh, god dang it. Okay, no, nope, that's not gonna work. Um, let's do this. Ugh. God damn it, man. That tape's actually pretty damn tough, but we got it. We're good. No, no, we didn't. We didn't. There's more. There's always more. Come on. Is that it? Is that it? Yeah, there we go. That should be it. Come on. <sighs> Alright. Alright. Let's get this baby cracked open. Okay. Oh, wow. Wow. So, it's got a very nice uh, finished box here. That's cool. That's cool. That's... I don't know why... It's in another box. I guess this stuff always comes in boxes within boxes. So very nice red color. Uh, it's got the HyperX logo on the front. Um, very Again, very smooth finished box. Uh, feels nice to the touch. Uh, so it feels like the same kind of box that my phone actually came in, the OnePlus One. 
Oh, that suction. Damn. All right. Oh, wow. Okay, so when you open the box, uh, you get this, which is a nice little touch. Uh, it says a bunch of stuff, has a signature from the general manager. That's pretty cool. It's a very nice box. I'm not gonna lie. A very high quality box. Tissue paper, because why not? Uh, let's see, it's got the quick start guide. Uh, this is for PC and Mac. Uh, let's see, PlayStation 4 as well. Uh, so it actually works for both. Uh, it also works for Xbox One. But you need the uh, controller adapter, which is sold separately, obviously. Um, yeah, so that's pretty cool. Uh, it also works for phones and the like of that, so that's pretty cool. Uh, very versatile device. That's pretty nice. Just set those aside. Uh, it comes with lots of foam in it, so nice and squishy, which is awesome. It's got that new box smell as well, actually. That's that's really nice. That's that's a nice touch. Okay, uh, once you actually get the box open, uh, this is what you're then greeted with. Uh, everything on the inside. So you got your microphone on this side here. You've got your actual headphones. Uh, you've got the like some replacements, which is actually those are those feel very nice, nice and squishy. Uh, those ones are cloth, whereas these ones are leather. Uh, you've got a splitter jack here, which is kind of cool, and then you've got the actual control panel here. So uh, let's get all this stuff out. And this is just what I can see uh, on the surface of the box. Uh, that's not going to come out just yet, then. Uh, you've got the microphone here, which, again, it feels very nice. Um, it's got a nice foam bit over the tip, nice pop filter kind of thing. Good on there. Uh, very flexible. Uh, it seems to hold uh, the shape that you put it in quite nicely, so that's cool. Um, it's got a very nice looking uh, headphone jack there, which will actually um, be a little bit sturdier in the uh, headphones, so it's, you're less likely to break it. Um, again, it's got a splitter, which can, again, be very useful. I guess that goes in to your front panel or something, or the back panel. I don't know. I'm not entirely sure. That's pretty cool. I guess that's your uh, microphone plug at the same time, I guess. Um, and then there's the control panel, which the wire leads underneath the box. So let's go ahead and take out this foam here. What is this bottom of the box? Oh, the bottom of the box comes out. So uh, you can take this out here, uh, which is right at the bottom. And that gives you access to the cables that are nicely tighted away underneath it. You get a bag, I guess, to store all the stuff in. Very cool, very very squishy, very nice quality. It's got a Velcro pouch on it as well, so I guess you can put in um, other accessories. But it's it's very soft to the touch, very squishy. So that's pretty awesome. Uh, it's a 7.1 surround sound headset, from what I can tell. And again, the nice packaging can, is very consistent all the way throughout. Very clean. Um, so you've got this control panel here, which has a number of buttons. Um, I guess. Oh, that's cool. So you can control your your microphone, and you can tr control the. Uh, come on. Focus. There we go. Uh, Seven point one button, which is nice. Uh, it's, this is also the USB controller. So, uh, if you don't want to have to use it via aux cable, you don't have to. Um, but you you can just use it as a straight up headset, which is kind of nice. It's a nice touch. Uh, so it comes with the. Plastic stuff going over the, I guess, polished metal. Is that actually? No, 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 no. I, I'm not sure if that's. No, that's that's metal. That's also a brushed metal. So both of these here are brushed metal. Uh, it's got again the symbol and a very nice highlighted red. Um, the threads are very nice. This whole top part here is leather. Uh, very squishy uh, with a nice red. Very uh, solid build. Like you can tell just by pulling it apart, it's very um, springy, uh, very tight, so it'll, it'll fit around your head nicely. Um, you can't twist it, which is a little bit, I guess, a downside. Though it also uh, means that it's just a stronger build altogether. It won't break uh, quite as easily. But with these headphones, you can actually uh, twist it out like this, uh, which is nice because like if you want to sort of set it on the desk and have the volume turned up, you can. Uh, it's you know it's whatever though. That's not a necessity. 
Um, if you're wearing a headset, you're wearing a headset to wear the headset, right? And uh, so I guess you don't need to have a turn. But uh, yeah, it's a very nice build quality. That's obviously the back. Um, all the cables seem to be covered in and like proper sleeved cabling, which is nice. Um, very good looking headphones. Not gonna lie, the the plastic here is a very nice matte color, so it's uh, very smooth to the touch as well. Um, does, it's not going to reflect a bunch of light. Let's actually uh, put it on and see how comfy it is. So you might not be able to hear me, though you probably can. Let's uh, try this on. Oh, already. Oh wow, wow. Ooh, uh, very quiet outside of of these headphones. Um, I'm not gonna lie, very comfy, extremely comfy, uh, very squishy. Um, it can cater to quite small heads, I guess, because with these I don't have to extend them, but these I do. Uh, though it's totally uneven. Let's squish that side down. There we go. Is that alright? Yeah, yeah, it's fine. No, nope, this side. There you go. Wow. That's a mean pair of headsets. Uh, headphones, huh? Uh, that side. That side. Yeah, no, very nice. Very comfy. Um, I'm, I was a little worried that maybe it would feel... <sighs> there you go. Pop that up. Yeah, very comfy. Um, the cable, you can't even feel it, really. It's not a heavy cable, which is nice. It's only got the, uh, got the cable on the one side as well. Um so you don't have to worry about the cable getting trapped around your neck or whatever like you can pull it off you know like like that kind of wrap it around um but yeah definitely very very nice headphones very nice headphones uh the packaging very pleased with uh even the inside of the box is a very nice sort of uh, matte black kind of color it's a very good sized box as well so it's you can definitely repurpose it quite well um just in general the build quality of these headphones are, is very very high uh, the fact that it comes with the replacement earbuds in case you want something a little bit different. Uh, I, for one, know that leather on a headset can actually be um, kind of annoying to some people, and it also makes your ears sweat, just sort of the area around your ears sweat a lot, um, and this would definitely help with that. Um, the sleeved cabling is a very big bonus. That's quite nice. It just means that the cable will last a little bit longer. Um, in general, it's not going to break basically to, to general use and wear and tear. Um, I like the fact that the metal is in a very sensible place. Um, I like the design. More than anything, the design is actually very sleek. Um, red is not my favorite color. Uh, purple is, but it's still a very nice red, so it's not overbearing. Uh, it's just on the highlighted areas, which is, is very nice. Um, in general, this is a very, very nice product. Um, I'm still yet to test out the microphone, obviously, uh, but it'll be tech testing that out compared to this. Uh, we'll do a quick tester and we'll figure out how that sounds. Um, yeah, very, very pleased with the build quality. Very nice. Yeah, awesome. So, uh, yeah, p uh, feel free to check this out on Amazon. Uh, pick it up. I don't know how much it costs. Uh, it's bought to me. Uh, bought for me, rather. So, but uh, just, uh, just everything in general. The the packaging was great. The uh, the bag's a nice touch. Not that I'm gonna be needing it much, uh, but it, again, it's nice. Uh, the box is very good, very sturdy box. Uh, gonna be nice to repurpose for something else. Um, yeah, very very pleased. Very pleased. It's a lovely lovely piece of kit. So uh, if you're in the market for a headset, definitely feel free to check it out. Uh, I will report back in a separate video about sound quality, microphone quality. Um, just that kind of stuff, really, all the stuff that's always good to know. So, uh, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. Uh, I hope you check out this headset, and uh, I will catch you guys later. Peace out. Bye-bye.